So GMB Aircraft is based in uh, Czech Republic, 150 kilometers at the east of Prague, where we are producing in between 60 and 70 VL3 evolution a year. Uh, about the VL3 turbine, we have now tested for three years this turbine, this engine, uh, three different configurations of engine, and we have now finalized the design. So after 100 hours of test, uh, integration of the hardware, uh, final tuning of uh, settings, engine settings, propeller, uh, combination with uh, manufacturer and the VL3, we are proud to announce that uh, development are done. So now the plane is ready to be delivered to customers. So this one is our test version up there. It's the first uh, VL3 for a customer. It goes to Austria, actually. And now you can order uh, VL3. And if you are uh, a lucky one, you will receive it within 15 to 18 months. So the VL3 Evolution is a retractable gear uh, plane. It's also available on request as uh, fixed gear. But uh, mainly we produce it at 99% with a retractable gear. The VL3 Evolution is now also just available at 750 kilo for the US market. We just finalized uh, the test, uh, test flights and all the resist the strength test. This is done. You can see the first one uh, just behind there, uh, 750. So the VL3 Evolution with turbine, the starting price is about 450,000 USD without tax and uh, then it's uh, customized uh, up to the request of the customer. So if you want uh, IFR capabilities or if you want uh, special uh, displays and uh, it, everything is possible with us. But in this basic price, there is the, of course, engine, propellers, rescue system. We have a ready to fly aircraft. So the VL3 Evolution is uh, customizable as you want. The plane is made on your request, not for us. It's for you, you will fly with it. So as you can see, the paint scheme here is special. It's a kind of military type, but it's matte. So it is on request. Of course, you can have a shiny paint, as you will see on the video. And the same for the leather. You pick your color of leather. You pick your leather of Alcantara, the belt, the wheels of your plane. You made it at your taste, not ours. Inside the plane is the same. Uh, the dashboard, as you can see here, is in more simple version because we use it for the testing. We use this aircraft for testing, but it's possible to have IFR capabilities, to have Dynon, to have Garmin, you can have multiple radio. We have uh, ADSB solution, of course, for the US market. The VL3 Evolution have uh, 140 liters uh, fuel tank. We will make, make it bigger in the future, but with this, uh, in this configuration, you are able to fly for about 1,200 kilometers uh, in a straight flight. So the turbine, as you can see, is a single lever uh, prop controller, so you don't have to manage the, the, the prop. It's auto automatically done with the FADEC. And thanks to this turbine, the vibration are completely uh, reduced uh, in comparison of a piston engine. So it makes the engine run smoothly, comfortable, quietly. This is really, really an amazing product for this. So now, as you can see, we have a Dynon HDX1100 in this plane. Uh, we are working closely with Dynon in order to integrate the engine parameter into the, the Dynon. As you can see here, we have an uh, engine, uh, engine monitor, and in the future, it will disappear completely to be fully integrated in the Dynon. So um, this is, uh, yeah, make the thing easier. Hello, so I'm Damien Fauvé. I'm the founder and CEO of TurboTech. It's a turbine that equips this uh, aircraft, beautiful aircraft. Uh, in terms of performance, uh, we obtain a very high speed of uh, 340 km per hour at 4,000 feet uh, for a very low fuel consumption. This aircraft, thanks to its uh, regenerative turbine, can consume something around 25 liters per hour at 230 km per hour and only 35 liters per hour at high speed, 320 uh, km per hour. So it's totally comparable to a very, uh, let's say, modern piston engine, like Rotax engine, for example. At high power settings, we consume three liters per hour of diesel, less than a Rotax engine. So it's a great innovation for light aviation, especially in very high speed uh, aircraft like the VL3.